Oh no! A flat tire! Morpho! Morph into a tow truck! Great! Okay, Morphle, to the garage. Hello there, we have a flat tire. Whoa, it's a living tow truck. That's amazing. It's called Morphle. If I could use your living tow truck for the day, I'll fix your tire for free. The first client we need to help is the ice cream man. His ice cream truck broke down. Okay, hook him up, Marvel. I'll have his ice cream truck fixed in no time. Uh, thank you, a Morphle the tow truck. Here, have uh, some ice cream. Ice cream! The next tow job is going to be a little bit more challenging. Wow, that truck is so big. Morphle, morph into a giant tow truck. Well, have I ever. Okay, Morphle, bring this truck back to the garage. W wait, M Morphle, I forgot to close the truck properly. Morphle, wait. Oh no! Look! It's the ice cream truck! Morpho loves ice cream! Ice cream man! We need your help! If Morpho sees the ice cream truck, he will stop for sure!
Here you go, Morphle. For every car you bring back, I'll buy you an ice cream. Great! Now we can take all these stones with us to the building site. Okay, Marvel. Let's go. Let's go. La 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 la. la. We need all these rocks to build houses. Okay, Morpho, drop them here. Okie dokie. Using a hammer, we smash the rocks in the right shape to build houses with. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. <laughs> smash, smash, smash! And this is where we build the houses. We lay the stones on top of each other and build houses. It's lunchtime. Don't you, Uncle Lawrence? Yes, I do. Because houses are the most important things in our lives. What was that? Look, look! Something here is eating its way through the houses. Oh! What could it be? Look! <laughs> <gasps> wow! It's a stone-eating monster! S stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! You cannot just go around and eat people's houses! Houses are the most important things in our lives, and you cannot just take them away from people. But Uncle Lawrence, I think we took the monster's house away first. Huh? The stone-eating monster came out of Morpho the dump truck. He must have lived in the pile of rocks. I, is that true, stone-eating monster? Did we take away your house? Uh -huh. Well, that's terrible. We're going to bring your home back to where we found it. <laughs> okay, Morpho, let's give the monster his home back. That's okay, Mila. We'll find rocks somewhere else. 
I think he wants to show us something. Follow, follow. Huh? I think he means he could use these rocks. Yeah. W with a lot of hard work, I could turn those rocks into houses. Huh? He's making new houses! Wow! That looks amazing, stone-eating monster! Now for the finishing touches. Eating monster, these houses are great. Wave a lake house. Yeah, I say we're a great team, stone eating monster. We should work together from now on. <laughs> oh, fixing a car is such hard work. Morpho, morph into a toy car. Hey! Daddy, play! <laughs> Morpho, I, I have to work on the car! Daddy, play! Daddy, play! <laughs> <laughs> Morpho, stop it! <laughs> <laughs> Could you please be quiet? I'm trying to mow the lawn, and your laughter is keeping me from my work. Oh, sorry, Mr. Vanderboos. But I guess you two are right. Sometimes it's good to take a break from work and have some fun. Morpho, morph into a real car. Another living car. Yes, it looks just like the other one. Another living car? Professor Tsung was just here with a living car. That sounds interesting. Can we go to see the other living car, Daddy? Of course, but I'll get back to fixing my car. Professor Tong? Hi, Mila Morpho. Wow! It's a living car, just like Morpho. That's so cool. Yes, my team invented this special device. It can set machines to life. We used it to set this car. And we have been running a lot of very interesting tests on it. But now, it doesn't want to do the tests anymore. We don't know why. Car no have fun. Car need fun. Oh? Yeah, Morph was right. Sometimes it's good to take a break from work and have some fun. Oh. Fun. I want to play soccer. Are you going to play soccer with us, Professor Tong? No, Mila. I'm afraid I'm too old to play soccer. I'll watch. But then we need a fourth player to make even teams. I have an idea. Daddy's car could be our fourth player. Huh?
go over there and make those loudly laughing kids play somewhere else. I need to concentrate when I'm mowing the lawn. You? I have work to do. I need to mow the lawn. I have a solution for that. Now the lawn will be mowed, and you can come play soccer with us. You can't always work. Sometimes it's good to take a break and have some fun. <laughs> station, please. Yes, sir. Can I please see our ticket? Oh, hi, Mila. I'm going to my laboratory. Okay. This naughty monkey and myself are heading to the zoo. Sure. I have to go to my auntie, the witch. She lives in a little house up on the highest mountain outside the city. Oh, your aunt is a witch? Yeah, and I'm a witch too. My auntie sent me a magic wand for my birthday. I'm going to visit her so she can teach me how to use it. The wand never works the way I want it to. Hmm, that sounds important. We should bring you to your destination first. Okay, Mr. Police Officer. Morpho, to the big mountain outside of the city. Okay, I will climb up the mountain myself. Great, Morpho! This is where we drop off Zookeeper Kenneth and the monkey. Hey, what's this? The little witch girl left her magic wand behind. Uh-oh, we should bring it back to her. Hey, monkey, don't do that! Huh? Where are we? It appears. 
appears that the magic wand has sent us to the North Pole. Code. I I want to go go back. It's way too cold here. Send us back to our city, Zookeeper Kenneth. Okay, magic wand. Back to the city. Wow! Where are we now? I'm pretty sure this is the Congo rainforest. Why did you zap us here, Zookeeper Kenneth? I didn't do it on purpose. The little witch girl was right. This magic wand is difficult to use. I'll try one more time. Magic wand, bring us back home. Oh no! We're in the ocean! Morpho, morph into a floating bus! I don't think we should use the magic wand anymore. We should bring it back to the little witch girl and her aunt as quickly as possible. Morpho, morph into a flying bus. Now let's fly to the mountain top where the witch lives. To your magic wand. We tried to use it, but it didn't work the way we wanted it to. Well, I know how to use it very well. The trick is, you need to make your magic spell rhyme. Where do you need to go, ma'am? To my laboratory. Pay close attention, my student. Magic wand, please do something for me. And bring this lady to her laboratory. The next thing I want my little wand to do is to bring these two fellows to the zoo. And this policeman is also in the wrong location. Please, Wand, bring him to the police station. Now you try. Okay. <sighs> it's getting late, so Magic Wand, please go ahead and bring my new friends to their bed. Ew! The garbage should have been collected today, but the garbage truck didn't show up. Morpho could become a garbage truck. Great! So, here's the garbage, Morpho. Let's pick up all the trash. And don't forget to find out the mystery of why the garbage truck didn't show up. Okay. Wow, it's a living garbage truck. Calculations with numbers and stuff. 
but my screen just shows the wrong things. Wow, that's so special. More for like, more for like. <laughs> Sun, that's really cool. You're not garbage. Do you want to be our friend? I would love to be your friend. Stuff. Throw them in the garbage truck, Morpho! No, don't! That garbage can be reused! Just like me! to build. A doggy. Doggy. I love garbage. Okay, more for the garbage truck. Now let's bring all the garbage to the garbage dump. This is the garbage dump. The gate is closed. We can't go in. Where is the garbage man? Garbage man, where are you? Hmm, it's a mystery. Bark, bark. Hey, the robot doggy smells something. I think the robot doggy has found the trace of the garbage man. Let's follow it. Hey, garbage man! Why are you here? Why are you not picking up the garbage? I don't want to be a garbage man anymore, so I got myself a new job. Here, at the flower store. Flower smells so good! Much better than garbage. Yuck! I really don't like garbage. You don't? I love garbage. Robot new garbage man! I could build so many cool things out of all this garbage. I'll get started right away. Wow! That's a beautiful house! We'll have lots of fun living here, won't we, Dougie? Bark, bark, bark. It's time for us to go home now. Bye! Bye-bye! Bye! Look, Morpho. That pile of bricks needs to be bulldozed away. Morpho! Morph into a bulldozer! Lately, big boulders have just been raining down from the mountain, and they keep ruining our newly constructed buildings. You see, it's another one. Okay, Morpho, push them away again. Morpho and I will go up 
the mountain and find out why boulders have been raining down. Oh no! Look, Morpho! Another boulder! Great, Morpho! You're strong enough! have been coming from? Wow! Look! It's a mountain giant! He's building a block tower! You wanted to stay up, don't you? And we can help you keep it standing. Morpho, morph into a cement mixer. <laughs> Uncle Lawrence always uses cement to make sure his bricks don't fall apart. Okay, Morphle, we are moving with all our animals from this old zoo to our brand new zoo, all the way across town. Okie dokie, Zookeeper Kenneth. I will bring all of these animals if you bring the biggest of all. The blue whale. But even though they're big, they're not scary. All they eat is plankton. And they love plankton. Oh, and there's one more thing. You have to be very careful of the animal thief. The animal thief loves stealing animals. 
we will be very careful. is getting away. Na, 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 na. We will bring you to the other side, officer. Na, 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 na. Da, 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 da. You've been very bad, animal thief. You cannot just go around and steal animals. You are going to jail. Now let's bring the animals to the new zoo. Let's go, Morpho. <laughs> My tractor broke down. There's no way I can plow the fields without my tractor. Morpho, morph into a tractor. Amazing! Yeah, plow the field, tractor Morpho. You did positively great, Mila and Morphle. The whole field is plowed. But now, I need to go to town to buy the parts I need to fix my tractor. But there's still something I could use your help with. You see, today is my dear, sweet Pigs Maurice's birthday. It would be great if you could help prepare for Maurice's birthday party while I go get my tractor fixed. Yeah, of course. And if you have any questions, you can ask all the animals on the farm, but not Maurice, because I want it to be a surprise birthday party. Okay. And I always love my birthday parties the best when there are a lot of birthday decorations. Yeah! We love decorations too! Right, Morpho? Hey! Morpho, don't play with the mud now! Okay, Morpho, first we need to think of where to put up the decorations. Hey, cow! What do you think would be the best place to have a birthday party? Follow him, more for the tractor. Yeah, the 
Princess Feud is a great place. Let's start decorating, Morpho. It's starting to look like a party. Party! Hey! It's a horsey! Do you have any tips for us? What else does a birthday party need? Yeah! Hey! We can use the hay to build a big birthday chair! But now, we need birthday presents. Dag, dag. Yeah, it's a doggy. Hey, doggy. Do you have any ideas on what to give Piggy Maurice as a birthday present? It's a squeaky toy. Thanks, doggy. Great, Morpho. We're done now. Morpho? Morpho! Stop playing in the mud. It's time for Piggy Maurice's party. He's coming! He's coming! Yes, yes, of course. Everybody likes different things. Some of us like balloons, some of us like mud. But all of us like cake. Cake! Yay! And now 
put a room here. If you drop some more sand here, I will make another tower more full. But a real castle needs a real moat to defend it from bad guys. That is super duper important. So, take a moat all around the castle. It's a lot of hard work. I'm proud of you. Now let's play knight in the castle. Morpho, morph into a knight's helmet for me. You want to be a knight? Okay, sure. No, that's okay, Morpho. You can be the knight first. And then I can be the knight later. Yeah! Nine, nine, nine. Hey, whose sand castle is this? It belongs to us. I am Mila, and this is Knight Morpho. Well, little girl, we are pirates, and we have followed this treasure map here. And it says that the treasure we are searching for lies right here, under your sandcastle. Uh, what? So we are going to tear your castle down. Whoa! to our castle is not that easy. Smart it up, Pirate Phil, and watch how I get over this moat without falling in. Hey, that's mean! Why are you breaking down our castle? We don't care if it's mean, because we are pirates. And the map says, whoever finds the treasure can keep it. Really? Then we are going to dig for the treasure too. <laughs> you think you can dig faster than us? We have a really big shovel. Well, we'll see about that. Morph, morph back into a digger. Okay, Morpho, now start digging. Yay! What? What is inside? Gold? Diamonds? It's something even better. Even better? Yeah, it's a knight's helmet. Okay, Knight Morpho, the castle is all rebuilt. Now, let's play knight.
This is amazing! A little girl and a giant red monster truck just won the race. Here is your award. Marvel win! Marvel win! Oh no, Morpho, watch out! Morpho, you smashed the award! <laughs> Morpho, what have you done? You smashed the whole front yard! Get out! Get out, get out, get out! And now you almost smashed those cars! Morpho, you should morph back into yourself before you smash everything! Morpho, a monster truck! You cannot stay a monster truck, Morpho! You're way too big! Hmm, I have an idea! Morpho, why don't you morph into a baby monster truck? Then you can still be a monster truck, but you won't smash stuff anymore. Oh, Morpho, a baby monster truck! Yay! Yes, that is much better. Yes, Morpho, go faster! <laughs> Watch where you go, baby monster truck. I have important stuff to do. I have to smash these old cans so they can be properly recycled. But Daddy, Morpho could smash those cans. Morpho smash! Okay, Morpho, smash them! Thank you for smashing all the cans, baby monster truck Morphle. You are such a big help. Here. What's wrong, Morphle? You seem sad. Morphle like a smash, but Morphle wanna smash a pig. Morphle wanna smash a car. But Morphle, you can't smash cars. Because cars still have to be used. They don't have to be recycled, like old cans. Yeah, 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 Morphle, we know. Well, actually, cars do have to be recycled. Really? <sighs> yep, at the junkyard. When cars don't work anymore, they're brought here so that something new can be made from the old metal. But before they can be recycled, they have to be smashed. Yes, Morpho, we have a lot of old cars for you to smash. Morpho smash! Morpho smash! Smash them! Oh no! The barbecue has caught on fire! Morpho! Morph into a fire truck! Okay, Morpho, use your fire hose to extinguish the flames! about a barbecue fire that has to be put out. Don't worry about it, ma'am. Our personal fire truck, Morpho, already put out the fire. Wow, that's a beautiful fire truck you have there. Yes, it's my magic pet. 
He's called Morpho, and my name is Mila. I'd say we could use a living fire truck at the fire station. Wouldn't you agree, Firefighter Sylvia? I completely agree, Firefighter Gerben. Would the two of you be interested in joining the volunteer fire department? You already are a splendid fire truck, Morpho. But the one thing you still need is a ladder. Morpho, add a ladder to the fire truck. Wonderful! Morpho is the best fire truck we have ever had. But Morpho, we also need a phone in here so we can receive calls from people that need help. Yes, just like that. Ah, our first call. Hi, this is Firefighter Sylvia speaking. What is your emergency? Oh, oh no. Really? We just got a call from someone whose cat got stuck in the tree. Oh, I thought you said the cat was stuck in a tree. Look, there's a lady in the tree. Wow, how did you get up there, lady? My little kitty cat Honey Bunch Fruity Cup climbed up in the tree, and I thought it couldn't get out, so so I climbed up to save it, but, but then it just jumped down, and now I'm too scared to climb down myself. Morpho, we need the ladder now. did very well, Morpho. Hey, another call. Hi, this is Firefighter Sylvia speaking. What is your emergency? A barn fire? Morpho, use the fire hose. My little kitty cat honey buds fruity cup climbed the barn this time and I got stuck again. Morpho, use your ladder again. This time she's too high for the ladder to reach. How can we get her down? Hmm. Mila, could you ask Morpho to morph into a life net? Sure. Morpho, morph into a life net. Okay, lady, jump! We saved you again, lady. That must have been really scary. You better take a bit of a rest. Yep, I agree. But I can't take a rest. My little kitty cat honey bunch fruity cup climbed up in that tree. I have to go save it! Morpho! Morph into an airplane! Wow! I don't think I've ever seen anyone fly as well as Morpho does. Whoa, wait, that's not true. The only thing I've ever seen that's better at flying than you, Morpho, is the Andean condor. It's a giant bird that I saw on my travels in Peru. Morpho better. Yeah, I think Morpho is better at flying than anyone. Let's go to Peru, Morpho and find out who's the best at flying. Peru is a country
country in the continent of South America and is very far away from where we live. Stop it! Stop flying! Why? Because this is my airspace. But we want to find the Andean condor. We heard it is the best at flying in the whole world. Nonsense! I, Esteban, I'm the best at flying in the whole world. I will take you to the condor only if you prove that you are better at flying than me. By competing with me in three flying games. First, you have to show you can fly through all these hoops. Like this. Okay, now I will show you the second game. Hey, what's this? It's the condor with the little boy on his back. Hey, give that back. That little boy is me. The condor and myself used to be the best friends in the world. But one day he didn't want to be my friend anymore. I think it was because he was scared that I would one day be better than him. And I am better than him now. And I am better than your gooey little red friend too. And I will prove it to you with this next game. I will let up these balloons that have presents inside them and the presents will drop out if you pop the balloon. Whoever collects the most balloons wins! Ha! I will get this one! There's another balloon, Morpho! Let's go get it! Look, Morpho, it's the condor! It is flying towards his nest. This is my chance to prove I am the best at flying. New game. Whoever reaches his nest the fastest is the best at flying. Follow them, Morpho! fastest doesn't make you the best at flying. Flying is about enjoying, dear. Flying is being free. That's what makes me the best at flying. And these little fellows know that as well. Come on, guys. 
Let's have fun. Fun? Fun? Fun! Thank you, my foreign friends. Together, we have shown Esteban how to truly be a great pilot. 